The Jag Panzer E100. This is a German Tier 10 tank destroyer, and the map is Mannerheim Line. I am going to get 5,000 damage in this game. I'm going to get two kills. Uh, looking for a good game. Uh, if you watch my channel, you'll know that I'm working on getting gun marks on all of my tanks. And uh, I'm firing gold rounds because I'm also working on a mission, uh, which is block 10 like a boss. I probably completed in this. Yeah, I'm going to complete it because I only need 4,000 damage. Oh, you know what? You got to survive. It's probably going to be another game. I had lots of games with over 4,000 damage this week or yesterday. I probably played this yesterday. Don't have a good angle here. And, you know, I haven't played this tank very much, so I'm really a little bit new to it. You notice that Bat Chat 25T is not in a good spotting position. This is a typical team layout for this map. Uh, you see the medium tanks go where they normally go, and the heavy tanks went where they normally went. Yeah, you see, we, we could have nailed that if the Bat Chat was spotting him, but he's right there. He's literally right there. Uh, he crossed over unspotted. That 279E, we're going to get him. We're going to go and pounce on him. I'm pretty sure. 1080 damage on the T110E4. I don't have a lot of experience with heat rounds. Uh, if you watch my channel, you'll know that I almost never fire gold rounds. I could go a 1,000 games without firing a gold round. Uh, so I'm really just starting out with the heat rounds. I'm really not sure much about how they work. I decided to advance. I thought that I was going to be pretty safe. I am moving to make sure that the white circle is outside of this sniping position over here to reduce the chance that I get spotted. Unfortunately, when you use uh, this, this style set, it doesn't show uh, all the, the progressive decals that you've earned. Uh, so I did remove it. Oh, yeah. Looky, looky. I did remove it uh, for future games. That was 1097 damage on the Skoda T50. So in future games, we're going to see all the decals I got on this tank. Yeah, if, if you watch my channel, you've probably heard me talk about this. Uh, there is a lot of my ideas that made it into the game. And one of them was, you know, I asked them to do something to keep track of our progression for mastery badges and for uh, other things that we've uh, accomplished in the game. And they added the progressive decal system. I am going to kill off that Waffentrager. I got 909 damage on that Waffentrager. So that Object 279E, he's not stupid. He's going to stay behind there. Wow, what a lucky shot. So when you first start out, you might think, should I take the shot? Should I not? Now I always take the shot. You know what? Maybe it's a little bit different because you can't do team damage anymore. But there was a time when I would have been very hesitant about taking shots. I'm pretty sure that 279 is going to be gone by the time I get there. Yeah, he's out of the game now. I'm up to 3,700 damage. You really want to trust the minimap. If it looks like the TVP is behind a rock formation, he's behind the rock formation. Score is 9-4. to four. I thought that we lost this game. Oh, you know what? That was a different. I think that was a different replay. I'm confusing it with. Okay, let's see me nail him. Oh yeah, look at that 985 on the T110E5. I got 4,700 damage. Got a little bit more damage left in this game. I did uh, complete the mission as long as I survive. I seem to recall at this point, I was like, okay, make sure you survive. Don't do anything stupid. 
I could blind fire at that standard. Oh, I had some great blind firing this week. Uh, that's 217 damage on the T110E5. See, I'm hitting the gas. I didn't want to go over the side of the cliff uh, because, as I stated, um, I need to survive to win the mission, and I just want to move on to the next mission. Uh, some of the missions are going to be tough because you got to do six kills um, for, for a couple of the missions, and there might be six kills against medium and heavy tanks. I'm not sure, but... You know, I can do it, but I don't know if I can do it with a German tank, or I don't know if I can do it with a Japanese tank. You know, I would pull out a French tank. And that's the game. 15 to 5, pulled in a victory, and I completed the mission. There it is. So I completed the mission, which is block 10 uh, for the Chimera. I did 4,979 damage, I got 56 spotting damage, and I got two kills. That's the Jagdpanzer E100. The map is Mannerheim Line. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you want to join my clan, it is CBKS.